Alright, today I'm on a mission to go get a stand fan. What's left of it? It's at my old school, so let's go see what's there. See there. Oh, we're at the school. And let's get to it. So we've got a few CRTs. One's been done in. You check the windings. Look to be alright. Spins freely. What we used to do now is just undo that. We take it away. Okay, so it's the next day and there was nothing left of the stand. It was there was one bit that was ripped off. There was nothing left of the cage, there was no blades left, so I've got blade set that I found and the cage off the old stand fan and that's the stand off my stand fan uh, the cage is from my stand fan as well so I'm just gonna go get it and we're gonna see if it works okay so the first thing I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to replace this plug because it looks like it's been submerged in water or it's damp so I'll give it a little clean first okay so the plug's been changed to a black one, plugged it in, looks like the motor's not got a lot of hours on it, looks brand new, Let's see if it works, oh as if, as if they'll throw away a fan motor, just like that, oh well, time to put the blade cell on it. I tried to put it on this uh, oscillator stand, but the hole's too small. I'm going to have to find a way to stand it up. Well, I've just tested it, and my god, has it got the power to turn those blades. Whereas my other one, it took a little bit of time to start up. I think the run capacitor is going a bit bad. But look at how powerful this thing is. This is on high speed, and it's got the old green blue blades if I can turn it on Yeah, well, that thing's got some power to it. For being a 2004 okay, uh, apparently. So I'll show you the ID plate and everything. It's a model SSF16D. Voltage, batch number 26 of something 2004. Apparently, was it the 26th of April? Uh, not April, yeah, April. We'll never know. That thing's got some power. Thanks for watching.